next three days after the day off tomorrow. Chapman goes in inning of the third, two strikeouts, one walk. Indian strand eight becomes strand 13 runners on tonight. But behind Jake Arietta, the reigning Cy Young Award winner, they got the early lead, they added to it. And even the series by splitting here in Cleveland, Friday night, Wrigley Field. Can't wait. Jake Arietta wins his first game of this postseason. The second of his postseason career. And with that, we'll go down to Tom Verducci. Thanks, Joe. Well, Kyle Schwarber, two days ago, you're playing in the Arizona Fall League. You have not seen Major League pitching in 200 days. Now you're in the World Series, three hits and seven at bats, two RBIs tonight. Can you please tell me how that's possible? I mean, you look for this moment. This is the moment that you that you want to be in. You want to this is the ultimate goal, the World Series, and uh, win it all. So, you know, a lot of emotions going into it. You know, obviously a lot of adrenaline. So you just try to put yourself in the best situation every at bat and just go from there. The offensive approach tonight, after getting shut out last night, the Cubs get eight walks. 37 foul balls, 22 of those on two strike counts. How good was the approach tonight against Cleveland pitching? It was great. You know, uh, like I said, we ran into a really good pitcher yesterday, and today we just wanted to stay with our approach. We felt like we put a good at bats yesterday. We put in great at bats again today, and uh, the results were in our favor. Now, Kyle, on Friday night, Brickley Field will host its first World Series game since 1945. Now, you know, National League rules. No DH. Will you be able to play the field you expect to be in the starting lineup Friday night? I don't know. You know, uh, we're going to take it day by day and uh, see where it takes us. Now, do you feel like physically you'll be able to do it? You know, I don't know. I haven't tried it. So, you know, I might try it out and see what happens and we'll go from there. We'll be watching. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Back to you, Joe. All right, thanks, Tom. He's a good kid. It's a great story, and he was right there front and center tonight for the Chicago Cubs as he came up with RBI hits in the third and the fifth. Jake Arrieta gets postseason win number three in his career. He had one in the wild card game last year, one against St. Louis in the division series, was winless in the NLCS, winless this postseason, but the reaction from Murphy's Bleachers in Chicago, where they are packed in, gotta be thrilled. The series is tied at one game apiece. Cleveland won last night. A final of 6 nothing. Chicago tonight, 5-1. to To Wrigley we go. To Kevin Burkhart and the guys, we take you now. Okay, Joe, thanks very much. And we welcome you to the Post Game Show, presented by Lethal Weapon right here on Fox. Frank Thomas, Pete Rose, Alex Rodriguez. And we have a lot to do coming up. More reaction from the field of this Cubs victory to get back in this World Series and tie things up in one. We will come back with that. We'll analyze this game. Kyle Swarmer, Tank Arrieta, what can you say? These Cubs, what they did, came here to do what they had to do, and that was take one of two. And now they go home to Wrigley on Friday night. And we've got ourselves a World Series all tied in one. Cubs win game two in Cleveland.